Morning, everybody. Kirk Yonke here in the Fox 31 Denver studios. Hope your weekend uh, was great. Hope your Monday is off to a good start. Of course, this morning we're following updates on the situation at Arapahoe High School. As we know, so many families, so many kids are, are still trying to sort out exactly what happened, why it happened. I think that's the tough question to answer right now. And we've got that senior, uh, Claire, who is still in the hospital. She's said to be in stable condition now, but at the same time, uh, she's in a coma as she works to recover. So we'll have the latest on that. We'll tell you what her family is saying this morning as well. And what investigators are saying as they work to, uh, again, piece together how this happened, why it happened. Um, also this morning, we're talking about the weather. Jen Broom here, and it's 45 degrees, 6 o'clock in the morning, and it's 45 I'm degrees. My Stop chowing down on what's going on? An egg? Yeah. That's your breakfast? It's taking me like 10 minutes to eat an egg. Oh. All right. Can you just hold off on the egg, please? Sure. <laughs> no problem. Pretty warm week? You, uh, well, at least the first half of the week. Okay. We have a mild Monday near 60. Winds at issue today. There is a big cool off, though, and oh. snow returns to the mountains by Thursday. Wow. That's a pretty quick change. Yeah. All right. Thanks, Jen. She'll be following that. Hank is here. Hi, Hank. Hey, good morning. That's Hank, <laughs> the man behind the green wall. That's where his desk is. He's filling in for Ken this week. Great to have him with us. Keeping an eye on the roads for you to make sure you can get out there. And I think uh, we got a couple of really interesting things that are coming down. First of all, Brian is back, the dog on Family Guy. Mm -hmm. Can you believe they killed him off in the first place? Well, you knew he'd come back. That's what I thought. And people were so upset. He's such a big part of the show. He is. Uh, he's my favorite part of the yeah. show. Yeah, but Seth MacFarlane came back and said, thank you for caring right. so much. So it's not really clear right. if they meant from the beginning to bring him back, but now they're going to have two dogs because they got Vinny, too. Hey, I got two dogs. Why can't they have two dogs? <laughs> <laughs> Touche. And uh, quickly, Peyton Manning, Sportsman of the Year for Yay! Sports Illustrated. That's really cool. Well deserved. Yeah. Don't you think? I mean, because he represents not just excellent play, but that grit and and class, really. Too. And he's flipping good. <laughs> I mean, he's just good. He's having such an amazing season right now with the Broncos, and so it's exciting stuff. The first Bronco ever to be named, the first Denver athlete ever to be named, and this award goes back to the 1950s. It's pretty awesome. Very we're awesome. proud of him. We're glad he's here. So those are some of the stories we're talking about. Breaking news as it happens. We hope to see you on TV. We're on Fox 31 Denver from 5 to 9. Happy Monday.